Yo, 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 what's the deal? It's your boy, Mr. Edwards Empire himself. You're also known as Polly King or whatever you want to call me. Today, I'm finna clean my jewels. My chains is dirty. You know what I'm saying? My bling ain't blingy. You know what I mean? So it's time to put some, put some shine back in my shine. So I get this from Kevin's Jewelers. You know what I'm saying? My, uh, this guy that look like, I guess, how they feel I'm gonna look when I get old. So they call them pops, they call them my pops. So we went with it, stuck with it and ran with it. And that's just what it is. So pops gave me some of this jewelry cleaner. He gave me something a long time ago. He gave me like three jars when he wanted me to buy something. So I was like, oh, all right, cool. So I remember, you know what I'm saying? Instead of taking it to the people's and make them clean it for $20. I was like, I'm gonna just go up here and get some stuff from pops. He worked at the mall with Kevin Jewelers, so I was like, shit, I'm just gonna get something from him. Feel me? So you take the stuff, dump it in the thing, in the whoop whoop, throw a little water in that thing, like wah wah. I don't do this if your jewelry's fake. You know what I mean? Your jewelry fake, it ain't gonna work for you. gonna do one chain at a time. We're gonna do all chains. Switch it around. Clean them, just push them around pretty pretty much. If I didn't have this, I would be using toothpaste to clean them and this soap to clean them with a toothbrush. And just clean the jewels, clean the diamonds up, get them shining real good. I usually let them sit in there for like 10 minutes, but I got something else to do. I'm just trying to clean them up real quick for Father's Day, you know what I'm saying? Get my jewel shining right. I don't want to be the only cat outside without, you know, without the jewel shining right, you know? Yeah, there we go. Are you looking clean? These are called Turkish chains right here. It's Turkish link. So you take it, water. I'm telling you, don't do this if your jewelry fake. If you got fake jewelry, it's not gonna work. You will be angry in the long run. Your chain will turn black. As soon as you put it in there, your chain turning black if it's fake. I promise you. Know your chain is fake. Do not, do not even put it in water, really. See the difference? You got it. Shine and clean. No light, no flash on it. I'm gonna put the flash on it before it's all over with, though. And then I'm gonna dry them up. Let them sit for a second. Then, um, going about my day, I gotta get fly. Big Turkish. Mm 
soon. These are strong chains. I really didn't like them at first, but they're strong. And they get clean. I like the way they be shining. This is an Alexander chain. I don't know, they just that's the name they gave him. Maybe he was the one who created this chain, this, this type of chain, you know? The style, I mean. Let's see how I got the loops and then the loop around. I tried to sell this one like five times, but it never really sold. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna keep it. Diamonds. Drop them. Diamonds. Drop them. The diamonds. Drop them. Put a little more water in there. Cover my cover the Mario face up. Oh. The diamonds. Drop. How y'all clean y'all jewelry? Oh, yes, that's how I'm gonna dress today, my fit. Oh, it ain't nothing. I just be trying to match and stuff. Don't worry about them clothes in the back. That's because I don't feel like getting them up just yet. So when I don't feel like getting them up just yet, I'm not gonna feel like I'm not gonna do it. I do when I feel like. You heard me? It's the whole point of having your own house, your own bathroom, your own room, your own space. Do whatever you want to do. I got to tat it. This is, this was finished this morning. Like two hours, like, like maybe 45 minutes ago. I got this one last night. I got thank God up here. And I got my crosses fixed. I don't know if I ever peeped those in any other videos. But go back, look, see those, now see these, see they different. I think I'm done with tattoos for a while. It's like I'm getting this other side done probably tomorrow. Because the flame, the flame and Cheeto guy. Not the guy, but the the uh the uh the little the flame and Cheeto emblem. A little hot Cheeto sign. I like to scrub the diamonds. They give it a better shine. No cap. Again. If your diamonds are not real and they're rhinestones, do not attempt this. Don't even clean them. Just let them shine until they go out. We all been there. We all had fake diamonds before. I mean, the people that like to floss and stuff. You just can't go out and just wake up in the morning and just go, you know, pay $50,000 for a nice piece or something like that. You gotta evolve and work your way up. You just can't wake up balling, you know, unless she was born into that family. Some people gotta earn their way and get how they get it, you know? And me, I work hard for my stuff. It might not look like it, but you see where I came from and you feel how I used to feel and you know what I mean? Live the life I live. You'll see, like, you deserve this. Whatever. This type of like a made a player. Oh boy, they, 
they get to shine. Sheesh. Oh yeah. Sheesh. Now we're shining shine. bright like a diamond. Looking real good, ready to put them on the chains. Head outside and bling bling. Every time I come around, we say that bling bling. Pinky ring worth, I mean wedding ring worth about 50 bling bling. Okay, check me out though. Ooh. Let me turn the flash on. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. That was no light. This is with the light on, put the flash on them things. Let's see them diamonds bling. And that's the end of that. Thanks for watching. Peace. One love.